All right, guys, a little quick video about uh, Lightroom Mobile and you, whether using using the HDR mode or the professional mode. Uh, let me show you what I mean. You see, I'm here on Lightroom Mobile, and you see here at the bottom, I have Pro and High Dynamic Range. Now, I used to only use Pro because what I love about Pro is that I could go into ISO and take it out of auto mode and go the lowest possible, uh, which is mm, for me ISO 2025. Okay. Uh, the problem, and then I would take my photo, ISO 25, I would just, you know, then play around with the speed uh, here until I get something that I like. And then I would press play with a two second timer on, timer on, and I was good to go. That's how I've been shooting with Lightroom Mobile most of the time. But now I found this new option called Hide Amic Range. Hide Amic Range. And on, so the problem with Hide Amic Range is you can't change any more the speed or the, the, the ISO, so you cannot guarantee to be at the lowest ISO possible. All right, so I'm here in Lightroom CC Mobile, and I want to show you, so this is a photo that I shot, if you see here, it says FPSC HDR, so it's an HDR from my iPhone 10 at ISO 40, because I was not being able to control the ISO, and this is a RAW file, so it's just a DNG, uh, but this time at ISO 25, so better ISO, but, if I use my presets, so I've installed all my future presets on my Lightroom uh, CC. Uh, and the way you do that, by the way, you just click here on uh, develop. You go here, you, you open preset. You can see that like, I have all my presets here. If you want to install my preset, and you can get them for free, by the way, by clicking the link on this video. I mean, not all of them, but a few of them for free. Uh, you can go here, click on three points. Uh, create presets, no, open preset folder, sorry. You click that and you drag and drop the folder unzipped that I'm gonna give you in the link under this video. You won't get all my natural every day, you're gonna get a few, uh, but it's a good starting point, it's all free. So this is the HDR, you see, now I have all my presets here, so I'm gonna go to the golden hour section. And what's cool about Lightroom CC is that when I hover uh, one of my presets, it's going to apply it. So I can see before I click it what it's going to look like. So I'm going to go in the golden hour. I think I'm going to go maybe on this one, which is golden hour light. Yeah, something like that. Or actually, no, I'm going to go on this one, the, the, the third golden hour. I think I like this. And then I'm going to go to the next photo, which is the known HDR. And I'm going to use the same preset, same settings. And... Um, the, the funny thing is, you see here, it's very noisy. Uh, it's very contrasty. This is completely burned, although I really underexposed the photo. And here, on my HDR, although the the ISO was higher, uh, I find that there's a nicer gradient. There's less noise uh, on this little playground thing. I just find it more cool. Uh, honestly, I think I would boost the exposure. So... Um, it's just a little video to say, try the HDR mode uh, on, on Lightroom. If you use Lightroom mode to take your photo, you will be surprised. I think, uh, you know, I got better results doing that than using the regular, uh, you know, the regular professional shooting that I've been doing so far. Don't forget to check out my welcome kit with my some of my best free signature presets, some of my best texture skies and brushes. The link is under the video. It's a messenger link. You're going to get it through messenger. It's fast and quick. Thank you very much and see you in another video.